Hello, welcome back. Still to come, Will and Grace star Deborah Messing will be opening up about the harsh realities of Hollywood and why she's now on a mission to fight for a fairer world. Plus, we will be talking Eau de Janeiro, as we'll be asking, how powerful is your perfume? Keeping me, Andrea McLean, company this lunchtime is Linda Robson, Janet Street Porter and Syra Khan. So after yesterday's show, we sat down all ready for our exclusive interview with Tiger King star Carol Baskin, myself, Linda and Denise, who'd come all the way down from up north, especially for this, were all excited and ready to speak to her. However, things didn't quite work out as planned. Have a look. Oh, by, by myself. myself. Don't wanna be all by myself. <laughs> this is so unprofessional, look. We're just about to go live or do an interview and these two are on the phone. We were supposed to be doing a pre-recorded interview with Carol Baskin. Denise, you've come all the way down <laughs> from way down Cheshire. From Cheshire. <laughs> we do completely understand yeah. that obviously last night while doing Dancing with the Stars, it must have been quite an unnerving experience for you and obviously then the following day to have to come on to British television and knowing that we were going to be asking you those questions but we want to say to you that the door is always open here yeah and you are always welcome to come on loose them in and just have a conversation with us but only when I'm on yeah thank you but only when but maybe she's there. been eaten by one of the cats I I, I think that's unlikely <laughs> So oh, we, we, we were yeah. here for we were so about excited, 45 we? minutes or so. Yeah, waiting yeah. While we were the looking team... everywhere for Amber. Where was she? Well, well the... she's obviously in America, and the team were trying and trying and trying to get through to her, and we just couldn't make contact. Now, obviously, when I was making reference there to the fact that she'd done Dancing with the Stars, we know how nerve-wracking yeah, that is. Yeah. But it wasn't just the Dancing with the Stars that may have spooked her a little bit. The, there was a, a, an advert show, shown during... Dancing with the Stars, which basically involved the the family of her former husband. I don't know if we've got a little a little clip of it that we can show you. Have a little look at this. I'm Gail. Don Lewis was our daddy. I'm Linda, and we miss our dad. I'm Donna. We need to know what happened to our father. I'm Anne. All we're asking is justice for Don. Don Lewis mysteriously disappeared in 1997. His family deserves justice. Do you know who did this or if Carol Baskin was involved? So Carol Ooh. Baskin has categorically Ooh. denied any involvement in her husband's disappearance. He was formally declared dead and she's now uh, remarried. So that was what happened. That explained to us in theory as to why she perhaps didn't show up for our exclusive um, UK interview with her. But... We did manage to track her down. Um, I mean, it basically, it caused a transatlantic search because yeah. Denise knows the executive producer of Dancing with the Stars. She rang him. He didn't know where she was. Eventually, Carol got in touch with us. She emailed us last night and said, I'm so sorry. I screwed up my ever-changing schedule. My phone is ringing off the hook with people being supportive or wanting interviews, but I just don't know what hour to hour where Dancing with the Stars is going to want me, and that has to be my priority. Now, Carol, obviously, during all the sort of toing and froing of booking her and then trying to get in touch with her, there's this huge time difference because obviously she's over in LA. Carol has been contacting Laura on our showbiz desk at some really bizarre hours, obviously, the very huge time di difference, as I said. She has said that she is available to chat to us even at 1 a.m. in the morning. So we thought. We might as well try now. Yeah. Should we give it a go? Yes, let's go. OK, so let's go to Doug in our gallery. Uh, this is where all the technical stuff happens. Doug, have you managed to get through to her at all? No. Oh, no. OK, right. Can we just reiterate then <laughs> what, we, what we said yesterday? <laughs> Carol, if you do manage to see this, as we said, the door is always open to, um, to have a chat with us. Carol has promised to give us her UK exclusive interview, so hopefully that will still happen at some point. So, Carol, the door is always open. In fact, we're just going to sit here and just wait. Yeah, <laughs> we may just sit here and Time just wait. Time for Linda to practice her singing. <laughs> <laughs> you, you'll be colder. <laughs> ooh, ooh. OK, now, from uh, TV no-shows to TV shows.